Now to gas prices. President Biden is taking action to try to give American drivers some relief. Yeah, but analysts say that it's going to take a little bit of time. Right now, across the country, the average price of gas per gallon of regular is $3.39. That is the highest since Thanksgiving of 2013. In Michigan, it's around $3.33 a gallon. But if you are in California, it's at least 470 in some spots that we've noticed it's even higher, upwards of $6 a gallon with counties seeing some very high gas prices out west. So what is being done to try and help us out? NBC's Chris Pallone is in Washington with more on the move from the White House. If you've driven a car recently, you know. It's high. What we can do. The average gallon of gas is up about $1.30 over last Thanksgiving when many of us stayed home because of the pandemic. Before heading to Massachusetts to celebrate with his family, President Biden took an unusual step to try to provide drivers some relief. It will take time, but before long, you should see the price of gas drop where you fill up your tank. He ordered the release of 50 million barrels of oil from the nation's strategic petroleum reserve, joining several other countries taking similar steps, hoping to force OPEC to pump more oil to meet worldwide demand. This is really a game of chess against OPEC and other oil producing nations. Analysts and critics say any effect on prices will take some time and will likely be minimal. Keep in mind this is happening globally. Um, and so uh, until things kind of settle down, until uh, oil production can catch up, we're going to be digging deeper when we fill our tanks. But while relief at the pump might be hard to come by, the president says things should be improving as people look for their favorite goods and gifts at stores from coast to coast. In the past three weeks, the number of containers sitting on docks blocking movement are down by 33 percent. Shipping prices are down 25 percent. More goods are moving more quickly and more cheaply out of our ports onto your doorsteps and on the store shelves. The challenges of getting back to normal as the world emerges from the pandemic. Several Republicans criticized the president for tapping the Strategic Petroleum Reserve, with one calling the move nothing more than a gesture. In Washington, Chris Pallone, NBC News.